you've said something very important about couples arriving their survival, and I just want to take a moment to expand on that, because if you look at our brain, and uh, Daniel Siegel, who is this extraordinary researcher of what he calls relational neurobiology, says that this is the brain in the palm of our hands. Here is the brain stem, the limbic system, the cortex, and the frontal lobes. In our survival, we are in a very different part of our brain than in our essence. To, to express our essence, we, we have an integrated brain. In our survival, we are functioning only from a, the oldest part of our brain, the brain stem and the limbic system. And so there's a lot to say, of course, about the brain, which is such a big part of encounter-centered couples therapy, the understanding of the brain and its function in a growing relationship. But when I ask people about the brain, they are in their integrated brain, not in their survival brain. And I am eliciting them to be in the, an integration that they may not have experienced in a long, long time. Mm. And it's as if then, if this is one person's brain and this is the other person's brain, they are now integrated brain to integrated brain. Yes. And that's very different than survival brain to survival brain. Yes. You know, Daniel Siegel calls the survival brain to survival brain the low road. Integrated brain to integrated brain, the high road. And what I'm doing by eliciting the dreams is I right away put the couple in the high road. They haven't experienced themselves being in the high road with right, each other. Right. They have known the low road, which is quick and dirty. Yeah. It's the reactive brain. And so we start there. <music>